Hey, what's up, people? Gagan this side. This is very old scene of mine. I did, uh, I guess, four to five years back, and uh, so just a thought to make a tutorial on it. So this is the final product we are getting, and uh, this was the raw render. Watch it till the end, so so that you will got to know how I did it step by step. So let's get started. And yeah, one more thing. If you are new to this channel, just subscribe it. In this channel, I will provide a very useful tips about how uh, post production works. So make sure to subscribe it. Just click on the red button under the video, and that's it. Uh, this is the scene. And uh, as I told you, sky is most important thing. So uh, I choose a sky for it. Then a little bit of curves on it. Okay, this is on another window. So let's take it here. So yeah, this is the sky, and the next is a grass. I just took a plain uh, grass texture from internet, uh, writing the grass uh, texture from Google itself, and then the lighting, lighting bars. As I told you, lighting is very important to give it a. Uh, a noon kind of effect it's highlight the areas from the direct sunlight and uh, the next is refraction and sorry for the naming namings and all it's a uh, kind of a mess because it's very old project i told you so yeah this is the cutouts cutouts from our grass and all i just uh, just uh, it's a very simple thing just uh, write down the whatever you need in the in your project just google it just write uh, for example you want the bushes just write bush pngs and you will get the bush and the next is creepers on the villa it's a villa kind of a thing so i just uh, took a uh, creepers the next is outer trees i just uh, did this trees just to give a little greenery kind of a thing and uh, this is a couple sitting inside of the villa the next is trees and the outer grass so that it will look little farm kind of thing this one is uh, for shadow as as it's in a dark place uh, as it's in a shadow place so a little shadow and dark here just normal brush i just uh, i just painted this particular area the next is trees some little flower kind of a trees to make it look good then one person sitting then a umbrella it's a umbrella and the reflection on the glass so just to show a little activity this is just a reflection on on this glass nothing much again people just uh, just to give it more realism for just to show an activity going on people again this is a normal tree just for a composition sake i just placed a tree here as a giving a good composition in this view some vignetting on the darker side of the view as uh, as sunlight is going directly here not here so a little dark for just a mood sake nothing much this is a z depth i just applied the z depth just to give a haze kind of a thing just highlighted this frames of the window by just darkening it from xtx then what i did is a uh, color balance curve color balance uh, and uh, selective colors and hue saturation so just manually uh, adjust your saturation mid tones and highlight according to your view it just need to look pleasing that's it so this is what i did i know it's a kind of a washout kind of a scene but i just uh, corrected it in in the magic bullet looks afterwards so yep this is my magic bullet layer looks and uh, i just use a little diffusion and some sort of color toning like it's a very old scene as i told you so i thought to give a little framing i just readjusted the framing maybe it will look much more pleasing than before so yes that's all i did from this i did this and if you close this thing out yep from this 
we did this so hope you like it please comment below if you have any question or you want something to tell me and just subscribe on to this channel and i will provide a very good information on post-production thing how to do it so yep thank you bye bye